According to Dart Viper, around 1 million people were fooled by this viral YouTube shorts video. It explains that the Union Depository Bank Manager from the Mission The Big Score was in prologue nine years prior in North Yankton. The observance among you would say that this makes no sense, as Trevor wore a mask during the prologue heist which obscured his identity. Yes, however, we can see Trevor takes his mask off during the robbery. You want to look at the face of death? Be my guest! The we can see directly chopper. after the heist that Dave Norton shoots Brad and kills him, and the money is lost. Dave essentially foils the robbery, and Traveller and Michael's identities are not released. There is a glitch in GTA Online that allows you to get into the interrogation room, where there is a picture of Trevor taken directly after the heist. This establishes that Trevor's identity was known to the police. But why wasn't it made public? Well, they always concealed their identities in the other robberies. And Luden North, North Yankton is just a small town, so news of this incident didn't reach Los Santos or Blaine County. Trevor walking around a populated city throughout the game without being recognized is evidence of this. Directly after the robbery, police would have interviewed the bank employees and shown a picture of Trevor to them and he leaves a lasting impression. You could counter that due to the trauma of the event, the hostage would be more motivated than most to remember what Trevor looked like. Tearing down these characters' supposed resemblance is fairly easy, as they only look slightly similar at best. That's the wrong guy. The bank employee is one in the back. <laughs> So we've established that the bank employee was traumatised from the robbery and he'd seen Trevor's picture so he knew what he looked like. Also he heard his voice during the robbery and knew that he was dangerous. So let's move forward to the big score where Trevor and Michael have taken the armed trucks and are going to rob the Union Depository. The bank manager pauses because he recognises the photo of Trevor from North Yankton that the picture of Trevor is an old one, oddly wearing his clothing from Prologue. Why else would Rockstar put that photo of Trevor from Prologue if not to make the connection between Prologue and the end mission? At that moment, the bank manager knew something wasn't right and he suspected Trevor as a criminal. Then he remained calm so as to not aggravate them and endanger himself and his fellow employees. Get many jobs after this? No, it's the last one. The manager engages in small talk, jokes around, and seems completely at ease, which makes little sense if he unexpectedly recognised the wanted murderer a few minutes ago. I respectfully disagree because from the bank manager's perspective, this is an armed robbery. And according to the police, during an armed robbery, it is important to remain calm, assess the situation, and do exactly as the offender says. Then, only when it is safe to do so, raise the alarm. Hey. Chance of an early death increases dramatically when you retire. Yeah. At this moment here, he realizes he's been robbed. He calmly says goodbye. Thanks. No. Thank you. Really. Then calls in Merriweather. Cargo is gone. Control. Pickup was good. How's it looking up there? Not good, man. Merriweather know we took the UD. They out there looking for you. So was the bank manager in prologue or not? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and subscribe to the channel for future videos. Thank you so much for watching.